What's up everyone? Welcome to this week's Tuesday Tip. This Tuesday I wanted to go over something very near and dear to my heart in recent times and that is uh, gut health slash digestion and what I am doing for it in the morning. Um, it's no secret after last year's competitive season that I wanted to you know, do everything in my power to minimize my waistline and a lot of that comes to down to how well your body is digesting its food. Um, and, you know, that process starts, you know, before you're taking digestive enzymes with each and every meal or, you know, before you're paying attention to what food sources you're eating and this, that, and another. You know, it starts with what you do when you get out of bed in the morning and what first hits your stomach. So I wanted to go over what I do every single morning and have been doing for quite some time. And I've come to really enjoy this, um, not because of how it tastes. I'm not going to lie. It doesn't taste that great. But because of how you know, it makes me feel and how it's, you know, really left my stomach feeling, you know, as I do this, the longer and longer that I do it, you know, the flatter and flatter, I feel like I'm waking up in the morning in terms of, you know, like any kind of bloat or distension. And then I just feel better throughout the day because, you know, at the end of the day, it's not what you eat. It's actually what you're able to digest and assimilate. And this really makes a big difference for that, in my opinion. So, you know, go over, you know, what I'm doing currently every single morning right now, I'll actually make it in front of y'all. Um, so what I like to start with is 16 ounces of water. Um, if you're not rolling out of bed and drinking like at least half a liter of water, you're wrong. Uh, so make sure you're doing that. But definitely 16 ounces of water because you do want a good hydration component with the drink. And first thing that we're going to do is two ounces of aloe vera gel. Um, I've made it quite a few times. I'm going to eyeball everything. I'm roundabouts. Close enough for government work, I swear. Um, the purpose of this drink, you know, a couple of things. First and foremost, it's going to be to, you know, like help heal and, you know, just soothe your intestines. Uh, what we do as bodybuilders, you know, it puts a lot of wear and tear in our digestive systems. You know, several of the ingredients are going to be uh, aiming to, you know, heal any distress that we have going on. And then several are going to be aimed to uh, really set up your digestion for the day, you know, making you making a very acidic environment and uh, detoxifying yourself as well. So after the aloe vera, next up will be lemon juice. So do whole lemons worth of lemon juice because these guys were kind of little. If you get big, big lemons, half's fine. Lemon juice does do a lot for the taste, that's why I like a lot of lemon juice in it. Um, after that, apple cider vinegar. Uh, this one comes down to, you know, I talked about making your stomach more acidic. It's also great for uh, you know, detoxing the body. A lot of really interesting research on it helping your liver uh, metabolize fat and stuff. So we'll do one big tablespoon of that. After that will be glutamine. This is the Pro Series glutamine. You don't have to use the Pro Series glutamine. I do recommend that you get a quality glutamine. Um, you know, I'm not going to say you get what you pay for with all supplements, but, you know, you want to make sure it's a, you know, high quality, you know, if it's a name brand ingredient, um, even better because, you know, they're held to stricter standards. So just use a quality glutamine and we're going to do, of course, the scoop is not on top, right? Jesus, going in. Man, that is all the way on the bottom. Sorry, this one was brand new. All right, so we're going to do 10 grams of glutamine. And, you know, this is a big one in terms of really healing any damage you have going on in your intestine, as well as being a great uh, immune system booster and recovery. It's a big fan of glutamine. After that, same story as glutamine. doesn't have to be revived. I use revive, but a quality greens powder. And that is going to, once again... Both soothe the, soothe, soothe the digestive system and uh, set up our acidity. Next up will be psyllium husk powder. At the end of the day, this is just basically pure fiber. So some kind of fiber component to your drink in the morning if psyllium husk doesn't do it for you. I will say this though, pay attention to the fiber supplements you're using because a lot of them out there, while they taste really good, they taste really good because they have like 5 or 10 grams of sugar in each scoop. So... If you're dieting, be aware of that. Last up, be revised GI Plus. Um, this is just kind of like a uh, like a kitchen sink, you know, throw it all in there. Uh, digestion optimizer from them. 
I've really enjoyed this product. Um, you know, they've ran out of it a couple times in the past, and I haven't been able to get it for a couple weeks here and there. And I actually did notice a big difference. So check this one out if you're looking for something else to add to what you're doing for your digestion. But yeah, that is the morning digestion drink. So I'm going to shake this up and throw it in the fridge. I like to make it the uh, night before sometimes if I'm not being lazy because then I get to roll out of bed and be lazy in the morning. <laughs> so throw this in the fridge. But anyways... That is the Tuesday tip on digestion slash gut health drink. If you like this tip, be sure to let us know in the comments. Um, always looking for ideas for these in the future. You know, we've been doing these for a while now, so I'm starting to uh, kind of have to rack my brain. So if there's anything you'd like to hear about or have my take on, let me know in the comments. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to the channel. I've been having a lot of fun uh, getting back on YouTube and doing this consistently. So hope to have you all along for the ride. See you all next Tuesday.